Hey guys, this is Danny's Auto Repair. Today I'm going to be doing a quick video on these ratchet wrenches by Suzumi. Let's open these up. And I want to give the guys a big shout out at Suzumi for sending me their product. Let me see, you have all the way from 8mm to 19mm. Okay. Now I believe they sent me the uh, SAE and standard. So this one is the metric size. Okay, it says 70, 72 gear heads. One turn of the wrenches requires only five. Okay, chrome vanadium steel, high hardness, high torque, rust resistant, long service life. Okay, ratchet heads rotates 180 degrees at any angle. So this is the metric one. And it comes in this nice little uh, case here, as you can see. Let me uh, put this over here for now. Check this one out. And this one is the uh, the SAE size right here. So this one goes from one fourth all the way to seven eighths. Okay. Very nice. No, I don't know how this comes off. Let's see here. Okay. See how it has these two little arrows here? You just pull it out. Okay? You just pull it outwards like that. So this is nice that they come in this nice little case here. So let's check these out. Okay. Very nice. Seven eighths. They feel pretty nice. I like this gold finish here. Seems like they well made. I like this nice uh, gray finish. <clears throat> Look at this, one fourth. Okay. This one is seven sixteen. Now I'm going to test these out on my car. I'm going to be doing another video right after this one. Along with this one, I mean. Testing these out. <clears throat> See how well they perform. Now I like these also because you can get into tight spaces. You know, you could turn it like this. 180 degrees. So that's pretty neat, you know. This is the eleven sixteen. Very nice. I'm looking forward to uh, testing these out. I'm really, I really like this uh, this holder that it comes with. Because usually wrenches come like in a box or something, and they're just there. So there you have it, guys very nice uh, carrying case here okay so now let's take a look at the uh, metric side metric set here nineteen Seems nice. I like that this has a little uh, screw here, like an Allen key type screw, like that in case this ever breaks or whatever, or you need to replace it. You just take out the screw, and that's it. Pop it, pop another one back in. 
Very nice. So there you have it, guys. Susumi. So this goes, like I said, from what is it, six millimeter? No, from eight millimeter. From eight all the way to nineteen. Eight, nine, ten. 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19. And it does not skip sizes, guys. That's the very nice feature. Very nice, uh, very nice feature that it doesn't skip a size in case you're missing a size that you need to work on whatever boat. You have all of them here. 11. This is 12. Okay. 13, 14, 15, and so on. They're all here. From 8 to 19. You can't go wrong, guys. 15. This is a common size on my car right here. 15. I have a lot of boats that are 15 on my Impala. Okay. Very nice. So we're going to be testing these out. I'm going to go downstairs right now. And I'm going to test these out on my car on a few boats, guys. So you can see and check them out. Okay. It's a very nice set to have. So I'm going to go downstairs right now. And we're going to check these out, guys. Okay. So I'll be right back. Okay, guys, I'm back. We're gonna be trying out the uh, ratchet wrenches and these bolts right here and these also and also these right here so I'm gonna put you guys right here Uh, this one here is a 15 okay as you can see loosened it with no problem guys okay You can turn them like this, 180 degrees. Okay. I gotta glue this together. No problem at all. Work beautiful. Okay. So now we're going to move on to this one here. See if you guys can see. Let me see here. This one. You know what? Let me put the phone a little closer. This one right here.
Now this other side is spinning, so let me get another wrench on that side. No problem at all, guys. And you see, if I put it like this, straight, this wrench is, is going to hit this base here. So lucky that these go to the side like that. You see that? Okay? That's where that comes in handy. You have enough space here to maneuver. Okay? Like that. Very nice. So I'm going to tighten this back up. Now they do tighten and loosen pretty tight bolts, but Remember guys, they're not designed to really add a lot of torque to these. So when you're gonna really do a, uh, your last uh, torque, you just switch it to this side, okay? But they work beautiful, these wrenches. No problem at all, as you can see, okay? So now we're gonna do one more. This one here. These are a little bit tighter. These are probably, I don't know, 35 foot pounds of torque on these. And they're loosening it with no problem, as you can see. Okay. Put a, another wrench on here because this bolt is spinning. But it did loosen it. Okay. Put one on this side and then this one over here. Okay, so definitely did the job. Now I do my last torque with this side, tightening torque. Okay, there you have it. So So as you guys can see, these wrenches did the job, guys. Very, very good. Okay? And also, guys, you can also get into tight spaces like you see right here by the manifold. Okay? Once you break that bolt, you can uh, put it like this. See? Okay? This is where the, the flex ratchet comes in handy. You could turn it up like this and then loosen it like this. Okay, very good. You get into a lot of tight spaces with these. Okay, so there you have it, guys. By Susumi. Now I'm gonna put a link in the description to where you can find these at. So there you have it, guys. I tried this one, which is the 15 millimeter, and this one, which is the 5.8s. Okay, so I tried both. So there you have it, guys. Bye, Susumi. Like, share, subscribe, and God bless.